Taurus, welcome to this Just In Time Tarot reading. If you're watching this, Taurus, trust that there's a message here for you. And Taurus, that message begins with this one. You're very close to achieving your goal, Taurus. What a beautiful energy. We see this kind of the moon, this kind of bright light here, things coming to completion, conclusion, illuminating the path forward. Of course, the moon energy is very much about your intuition and, uh, you know, the results and the success is yet to be revealed. So you're very close to achieving a goal. Let's dive into the Oracle of the Angels and get more information. Success. Oh, I've just done the Capricorn reading and that was the same card that came out. So you might have a significant Capricorn placement in your birth chart as well. You're very close to achieving your goal, Taurus. The success is yours. Things are still flowing. Things are still moving. If you're getting some insights and intuitions about, you know, final actions or tweaks, this is the time to put them into action. Right, let's go to the full tarot deck, Taurus. So I've got this beautiful, accurate AF tarot my first ever round tarot deck. I love it. It's very much my vibe. You'll tell by the graphics when I flip the cards. Now, um, there's a link down below if you want to learn more about this deck and even a discount code if you want to get your own. All right, first card out. We have got Queen of Wands. Now, that's an Aries energy coming through. You might be dealing with an Aries, but otherwise, you know, this is the energy of determination to keep forging ahead, right? What are you forging ahead to? Well, you're forging ahead with your manifestation. Um, you know, it links to the Ace of Wands. So we've got growth here and you know there's so much potential. And the Aries energy is saying, keep going, right? Keep leaping in, keep making calculated moves, right? This is going somewhere. In fact, you're very close to achieving your goal. But maybe you haven't seen you know, results or outcomes. But just because you haven't yet doesn't mean to say it's not about to happen, right? It might have just been, um, you know, simmering or in a gestation period. The Two of Swords is here, and this is indecision or avoidance. So maybe you have been indecisive about what you're working towards, maybe because you haven't seen the results and you're wondering, should I pull out of this? Like, or maybe it's kind of got to a bit of a stalemate here and things haven't really been um, moving or like I said, you haven't gotten the success that you want. And I always come back to this kind of um, metaphor of when we plant a seed in the ground, right? And we then we have to nurture it and water it and we have to wait patiently. And sometimes we have to wait months before that green shoot comes up through the ground. So maybe you just haven't gotten green shoots, but that just does not mean that, you know, it's not... Um, you know, like gestating in the ground, right? And about to just sprout up. Okay, so I think your green shoots are coming. And green shoots very quickly can flourish too. I have got the Dawn of Cups, which is the Page of Cups. Now, this here is the energy of curiosity and discovery, but it's often an unexpected uh, sort of new element, new messenger of opportunity, new like creative input here into what you're working on so maybe there is um like something like a catalyst that's going to speed this up somebody with an idea or you know i would be paying very close attention to the conversations that you have they can be someone that's even unrelated to what you're doing but it just plants that seed or maybe it's the fertilizer that you need here so it's usually an unexpected happy outcome right and you're being asked to remain open and curious uh, to ideas, to new specifically creative or left field ideas with that card. And yeah, Ace of Swords, breakthrough, mental focus. So through applying that and keeping focused and keeping open, the Ace of Swords is a victory card. And it's clarity and breakthrough as well. So I think that you're very close to achieving your goal and there's a really big win here for you and a victory. But I think that there is another kind of element to uh, actually bring in to this. Now I've got fortitude, that is strength. So you're being asked to, you know, to basically stay determined, stay brave, um, keep going. There is a new level of potential that is about to be unlocked here. So that's essentially what I have for you here, Taurus. You're being asked to keep going. 
you're very close to achieving your goal and very close to success. Until now, I think what you've been working towards, and look, this is a general reading, so it could be so many different things here. I think before you come to this reading, you're in a little bit of a stalemate here. You're not getting the results or success, and maybe you were thinking about pulling out of this, and maybe you're starting to have those sort of thoughts that are blocking you, like, you know, this is never going to work, or where's the results? And then we've got the, the Page of Cups coming in, which feels like new energy, or like I said, some kind of new approach, or something somebody says, or some help coming in, that brings you to the Ace of Swords, the breakthrough moment, the moment of clarity that heads you to the win, and with a bit more strength, courage, and patience, your green shoot comes out of the ground, and if you keep nurturing that, we know that that can grow, that can flourish, and that can bear fruit. So that's what I have for you, Taurus. I hope you enjoyed this a little message. If you'd like a personal reading to tune into your specific circumstances, please do follow the first link down below. It might be the second one because I'll link the tarot deck first. <laughs> so um, you'll find that down there. Pop over, check out what I offer. Please do like, share, comment, hit subscribe on your way out. That's what keeps the, the studio lights on and uh, keeps the free readings coming. So I'd be super grateful for that. And do come across to Instagram if you're interested in daily readings and content from me. I'm wishing you love and magic. I'll see you very soon, Taurus. Bye for now.